Hi everyone, so today we've got a nice video that is three mods for the price of one. So, one view that is. <laughs> so we're checking out three mods today, just to get uh, a decently long video uh, and show off some good mods that are smaller mods that I just wanted to show off. Um, so first off is a tankard replacer by Jfresh, the Meatstein. It's a barrel type um, Meatstein replacer for all basic tankards in the game. Um, they are very immersive and cool looking. I've seen them all around the taverns. They do look cool. They really stand out because they're nice and nice looking textures. So that's the first mod we're gonna check out. Well, actually, it's one of the mods I checked out. I think the first one is gonna be King Port's Skeletons of Daggerfall. So what this basically does is this long ago in the land of Daggerfall, there lived a creature with such a fearsome screech that all who listen is filled with fear. Now in the land of Skyrim, the creature has returned. It's named the Skeleton. Wait a minute. Skeletons make whippy noises, right? Not anymore. And all skeletons in Skyrim make the high-pitched screeches they are from the straight Elder Scrolls 2. Daggerfall. Now all Skyrim skeletons make the same noises as a Daggerfall skeleton, so I think that's funny. It also affects Dragger, so... I think it's awesome, so... <laughs> We're going to be checking that out, too. Then also, the final mod is going to be the Dawn Guard Mage Armor for male and female. So, uh, you can slay vampires in style, and it can be used with CBE body, so... Anyway, you can craft any smithing station under Misk. Um, and there's also some enchanted versions, and it counts as light, so we'll look at everything else with that. And if you get where the complete uh, set of it, you get 25 less damage from vampire attacks and drain life spells. So like I said, male and female version, and there's also just a female version because the mods said they couldn't update it. And uploading. So, anyway, we're going to first off check out the skeletons, because they're just skeletons of white run. Screech. <laughs> I like it. The screech is so loud. <laughs> it's so loud. It's so loud, so you're gonna know if you're gonna be fighting skeletons and drag now because you're going to hear that loud pitch scream. They don't even have... Oh, they don't even have... Voice gland, whatever they're called. Um, so that's pretty much that mod. Wow. I just annihilated those skeletons and they were screaming like crazy. So we're going to go check out Tankard, so we're going to head to the nearest tavern. And they should just be everywhere, so. I'm gonna just run there real quick. And just check out those. Then we'll be checking out the armor. I believe I'm wearing it. If I am, so. He's just got a sneak peek of that real quick. <laughs> uh, but, we're gonna head into the Drunken Huntsman. And check out the little tankards. There's a lot of them in the ends and stuff. Doesn't look like there's very many in here. That sucks. Well, I thought there would be ones in here. I'm sorry, guys. I just assumed there would be some in there. So let's go to the other place. Because there's like a ton of river wood, so I just assumed there would be some, like a ton in here, but they have like the other ones, so. Go in here. There should be some in here, I hope. I just want to check them out, because, you know, that's another mod. Aha, yes. They Hello, are. friend. Are you enjoying it? See? <laughs> it looks like a tiny... Look how, like, good the Praise graphic is Thanos on that. And all like, the, the texture is so beautiful on that. White run has been liberated by the true it's a little bigger, I think, now. People around. It's going through the hand. Ooh, there it is, a tankard. Look how beautiful that is. Nice. Thank you. Do that. Look at that little tankard. It's so beautiful looking. Is that just under misc? 
I think that's just under risk, right? I don't know where tankards are. I don't really think it's got a use to it, really, just to be in your inventory. Oh, I actually have one in my inventory. Nice. <laughs> so look at the really good uh, texture it has with it. It's a really nice retexture. It's a simple mod that does that, but nonetheless, I like it. It's got can on the bottom. <laughs> I do like this mod just because, you know, I like little texture mods and I already forgot what the old tankers look like, so I'm never going back to them. <laughs> so anyway, next up, we're going to go to the good old cheat room. Check out this new set of armor because I can show you how to craft it and then we'll check out the male and female version of the video. So anyway, if you go... In the Blacksmith Forge, you're going to want to go down to Misk, and you'll have the Mage Armor, which you'll need a few things like steel ingots, leather, and leather strips. Then if you want to, you know, make it better, you're going to need, like, a bunch of other ingredients for the enchantment. You need, like, this, some more steels. Um, you need the actual regular armor, and you need some silver, and some vampire dust, so you need to kill vampires. Then you get 100% uh, disease resistance, which is awesome. You get some standard generates 30% faster for enchanted. Uh, one hand attacks are now 30% stronger. Uh, then you got magic regener regenerates 60% uh, faster. Then you can also have an invisible version, which is pretty cool. And still get the light armor uh, plus and uh, magic other regenerates 60% faster. So that's a good uh, perk to it. So. I like when mods do that because then you can, you know, have a better, uh, you know, have to wear a helmet, so that's pretty cool. So this is what it's going to look like. It's a simple looking uh, thing for your Dawn Guard. It's overall looks quite awesome to me. Um, it's simple, but it does look really good. And I do like it for if you're going to play the Dawn Guard, which I never actually did play the Dawn Guard. I, always, I just was a vampire. I kind of want to um, go back and do that because I never did that before. Um, but it is look cool uh, to wear this. Definitely, if you're doing like a Dawn Guard playthrough or something with that. Well, if you plan on joining the Dawn Guard, it's just something to wear. So overall, it looks awesome. Then, like I said, there's the enchanted versions, and you can just take the hood off. Just have you know both on, okay? You can have double the you can have double the um, armor rating. <laughs> it's awesome, nice, and you can enchant it. Everything. Oh, that means you can have double the uh, mana regeneration. That's to be overpowered. It'd be 120. So you just have your character like this, and just. Yeah, it looks pretty good. And everything's enchanted, so you're going to be beautiful and have like a ton of regeneration. So that's awesome. So if we run over here, we're just going to, you know, see what it looks like on a, uh, your male character. Probably not much different, but I'll check it out anyway. So I sometimes like to do that. Yeah, it just doesn't look that different, but, you know, still got the difference in there. Looks really good though, I like it. And but yeah guys, those are the three mods you can download from you know this episode. Uh honestly I liked all of them. I mean armor mods probably the most uh uh useful one. I mean the skeleton one's cool, it has add some sound effects that are kinda entertaining. If you're a big fan of Daggerfall and do not like the sounds that they make currently. And you just want some screeching sounds to randomly alert you when you're running around places. Then it's a good mod to have. But anyway, I liked both of them. I like the tanker too. And I did like the armor, so it's all good. So if you guys want to download any of these mods, they'll all be in the description and link linking them around. Uh, so if you guys want to download any of them, like I said, it'll all be in the description. Uh, a lot to download, but you know, you need to download all of them. But, you know, like and subscribe. I'll keep making a lot of videos. Keep making ones like this because there's always a lot of small mods I need to review. So, 
Anyway, guys, like, subscribe, all the good stuff, and see you guys in the next video.